Okay, and it's all rolling. Um, it's hard to believe so much time has passed, but it really has been over 10 years since we first started talking about setting up this foundation. We first started talking about the foundation when I was recovering from my own deep flap reconstruction. Like so much in life, it's a story of, of fortune and misfortune. I first had breast cancer when I was 29. Um, and it came as a complete surprise. I was healthy, athletic, had no family history, but um, there I was with cancer in my right breast. At the time, I did a ton of research. I asked a million questions. Um, I sought a lot of second opinions. I think probably trying to find someone to tell me that everyone else is wrong. But through it all, I assembled enough Data, so I was comfortable with making a decision to have a lumpectomy and radiation and chemotherapy. And, uh, and it was a great decision. And I had 18 years that were cancer free. 18 years later, I was diagnosed with breast cancer again in the same breast. And unfortunately, I was part of a US healthcare system um, which, where insurance didn't cover a recurrence because it was classified as a pre-existing condition. So the fortunate part of that was that I was free to really make my own decision and about who and where I was gonna be treated. So I went back to the research and in 18 years, as you can imagine, a lot had changed. And so I asked a lot more questions and I diagrammed the answers and I looked at the risks and I looked at the costs and I, I settled on having a mastectomy and a deep flap reconstruction. Once I made that decision, then the decision was who to do it. Mm -hmm.